Hola y bienvenidos. Hello and welcome. I'm Rebecca Tomas, Rebecca Thomas, and I am a teaching artist from Arts Westchester. I am here to share with you and teach you some flamenco. Flamenco is an art, it's a culture, a song, a dance, and a music from the south of Spain, a region called Andalusia. And it, it began hundreds of years ago um, with a mixture of cultures and religions that lived together in the south of Spain, including Southern Spanish Christians, Sephardic Jews, Moroccans from North Africa, and a group of gypsies who came over from India and settled in the south of Spain. And over many, many years, all of their different styles of singing, of dancing, of making music and poetry came together and created what we now have as flamenco. So I'm going to start with a short demonstration of what the dance looks like and then we'll get to it. Vamos allá! the singing sounds like. You also heard some percussion, which you heard actually was a percussive box called a cajon, um, which is a, a wooden box that has some guitar strings in the back of it. And it actually originally began um, in Peru, but it was brought over to Spain and has become an instrument in flamenco. Um, and you heard guitar, la guitarra, which is also one of the major instruments in flamenco. So as a dancer, we are our own instruments. And so you heard me do a little bit of what's called footwork, zapateo. Um, and so I wear these shoes. They're very specific flamenco shoes. They have thick, chunky heels, and they have nails in the toes and in the heels. So they're not taps, they're nails. When I go to Spain and I get my shoes made, I go to the zapatero, and he's sitting there with a shoe in his hand and little tiny nails that he has in his teeth and he takes one at a time and he nails them in. And that's how you make um, flamenco shoes. So I'm actually going to have your sitting to stand up and we're just gonna practice a little bit of what we call zapateo. Zapato is shoe in Spanish, zapateo is footwork. And we're gonna put it together in a short combination. So we're gonna straighten our legs, we're gonna do a little, little plie and we're gonna bring one foot back, un plie atrás y uno, dos, those are golpes, they're strikes. Un poquito más rápido, a little bit faster. We're gonna go. Okay, so it's a very basic um, way of doing zapateo, the golpes. As a dancer, I also use another instrument which you didn't see in the first um, little demo. And that's this instrument. And this, I'm sure you've seen before, if you've seen flamenco, very typical. They are called the castanets, las castañuelas. And often I ask, what do they look like? What do they look like to you? And people will say shells, because that's what they do look like, right? So they actually used to be made from shells. Spain is located in Europe on the Iberian Peninsula, a peninsula being a large amount of land that sort of juts out in the water. And there's a lot of coastal area, which means a lot of beach, which means a lot of shells. Um, but the shells broke easily, so the Spaniards took the wood of a chestnut tree called a castaño, 
and thus became the castañuelas. So you can either sit or stand up and you're gonna hold a big beach ball. And with your middle fingers, you're gonna make uno, dos, tres, uno, dos, tres, uno, dos, tres. We're gonna go up, arriba, abajo, arriba, abajo, fuera, out, out, dentro, fuera, out, and in, dentro, and stop. Muy bien. So the left hand actually does that. I'm gonna be your mirror image. You go uno, dos, tres, uno, dos, tres, uno, dos, tres. The right hand is a little more complicated. And you start with your pinky and you go all four fingers. You go pinky, ring, middle, index. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, uno, dos, tres, cuatro, left. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And I'm gonna switch back so that I actually have my right hand. So I'm going to take them off, and we're going to go to another type of sound or instrument that as dancers we also have on our bodies, and that's our hands, what we call palmas. So in Spain, I told you about the cajón, um, which is one of the major uh, percussive elements in flamenco, pero las palmas, the palms of our hands, are very important. So what we're going to do is we're going to learn how to play them because they are really the most um, essential percussive instrument. We're going to hand, so manos en la cintura, hands on your waist, hombros atrás, and we're going to bring out our palmas. Now there's two types of palmas. Rub them together and we're going to kind of open up the Oreo cookie. And we're going to do a palma sorda, which is a low pitch, and you're going to kind of cut your hands like this. Palma sorda, and we stop. And now we're going to do a palma clara, which is a higher pitched, which sounds like this. So what we're going to do is we're going to put a combination together of um, dancing and we're going to start with palmas and the palmas that we're going to do is in a 4-4 four, four beat. So there are four beats per measure but we're not going to clap the first beat. So we're going to go open, two, three, four, y dos, and tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, we're going to stop on it, we stop Okay, and then we're going to go to claras with a variation. We're going to go uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, and stop. Muy bien. So those are palmas. Keep that in mind. Keep the zapateo that we did before in mind also. And now we're going to do something which is called um, floreo o con las manos. We're going to put a little bit of um, chill music on. So some um, flamenco is upbeat and some is kind of very slow and um, can be even more full. And so what we're going to do is we're going to put our hands out and we're going to lock our elbows and we're going to go out with our hands and come up. Fuera. 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 And now we're going to come in, change directions. Dentro, 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 dentro. Shake it out, okay? And now when we go out, when we go fuera, we're going to lead with our middle finger. So we're going to go fuera. We're kind of making these sort of like floreos or flores, flowers, okay? Now, um, men also do this, but they can also take their sort of two fingers or hands all together and make sort of like a stronger all together look, okay? So we're gonna bring our arms and we're gonna work with our full arms. From the floreo, we're gonna bring our arms down. Brazos para abajo. We call our arm work braceo or braceo. And we're going to bring one arm down here and come up. And one arm down here and come up. And bring them both down. Con floreo, con las manos. Bien. And we're going to reach out and grab something here and grab something here 
mano, mano y arriba, arriba, arriba. Muy bien. So that's just a little bit of simple um, arm work, braceo con floreo. And now we're going to put everything together. We're going to put a combination, a little choreography. And we're going to start with bottom muscle. We're going to do this again to a four floor rhythm. And I'm going to put that on. Love the music by Calvin Hazen.